Okay, so do you know what we're heading towards right now? I have not the slightest idea what we're doing. Awesome. I mean, you know we're going to explore an abandoned place, yes, right? I know we're exploring an abandoned Navy building, maybe. But other than that, I have... We're in a landlocked place right now. Okay. Hey guys, welcome to Travel with Austin. I'm Austin. And recently I took my friend Ethan to the TNT Zone in West Virginia for the first time ever. And while I was there showing him around, I decided that I would just make a video of him seeing and exploring the warehouse up there for the first time ever. So that is this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you do, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. What's in the box? I don't know. That wasn't here last time I was here. That's fishing stuff. There's sand. Is that corn? Hmm. No, there's no corn in there. Yeah, there is. Is that corn? Look. Corn. Or... You know what that is? What? Oh, okay. You can see by the formations of the bars that something busted out. Something Those are supposed to be windows. I'm not exactly sure what this was. But, yeah. Those doors are way ahead of their time. Oh shit. Dude, something busted the fuck out of that. Yeah, that wasn't like that last time I was here. Oh wow. Okay, so last time I came here, there were like boards and stuff. Like, people had obviously just been playing paintball in here. But now, it looks like they burned it all. There's a lot more birds in here than there were last time. But it's also summer now. Yeah, so someone definitely came in here and had a party. Yeah, this whole place last time I was here was all set up for like paintball. I mean, still stuff over there, but it was a lot more. I do see some alcoholic beverages. I do as well. Then, these were the offices. Yeah. I didn't actually go in here last time I was here. I just kind of looked at that room. So whatever this was, this is the offices for it. I mean, maybe those were supposed to be doors. It just seems weird to have so many doors up front. It's destroyed. Someone's there. Real. Real eyes, real. real I don't know. <laughs> I love the wallpaper in here, honestly. Shit. Yes. Yeah, I don't really know what they did in here. What? Oh, I forgot that door was there. Yeah. This whole place is just kind of, I don't know, I think it's really cool. What if we get the black mold? 
well, I probably already have it. Bless you. Yeah, you can like. Yeah, I mean you can kind of like walk up here, but. A what? Ooh, yeah, I didn't realize that this has like been replaced. I'm gonna skip that step. But like when you come up here, it's just. I don't know why they'd have this here. Oh, that probably makes sense. But it, it looks like it's thin wood. Die like a hero going home. Not sure what that means, but okay. I don't know, it's like a pit. Yeah, I'm down don't know, it's pretty it's pretty deep. I honestly think if I fell down there I wouldn't be able to get out. Yeah, I definitely don't think you would. Oh, I don't even know if my camera can see. Yeah, I don't know where they keep getting bed springs from around here. And then Yeah, this whole place. I don't know, I'm pretty sure it's part of the um management the wildlife management area. I really don't have any idea. Yeah, I think someone made graffiti that. But there is a there's windows up there, so honestly, I didn't look out this side last time I was here. I don't think. Oh, it's off. Yeah. Um. There was like a whole gravel road that you can kind of drive up here. I imagine people probably park there. I'm gonna guess this just goes out front, maybe. I'm not gonna open that. Yeah, I really like this place. Um. Oh, it's called the Party Zone. Reopen. It reopened six twenty four. Fourteen or. I don't know, maybe it's 19, maybe it's reopening as in like, they're going to reopen it, oh, sorry. Yeah, so here's just some of the doors and stuff they turn into graffiti, or paintball. This wouldn't be a very good place to play paintball, I don't think. I guess it'd be cool in there. Yeah. Oh wow, is that, is that Decepticon logo, or the other one? Decepticon, okay. I can't remember the good guy's name. That's probably not a good thing. Oops, sorry. Oh wow, there's a lot of glass. Oh, what's the say? Trevor. I. Oh, it doesn't even say Trevor. Trevin something something. Man, I swear the last time I was here was only like March, and there were no none of those weeds outside the door. Someone was probably taking care of it. Uh, I don't think so. I wonder what this place used to be. I don't know. I tried to look online. I had, obviously, it has nothing to do with the uh, bombs, right? I mean, it could have. This is part of that area. Like, where we were was only about a half mile away through the woods. Um, can't really get over there right now. Yeah, there's this little pump house next to it. But I don't think we could get to it right now just because of... You have to, like, had to crawl under a pipe to get there, and there weren't any weeds there last time I was here. Yeah, there's a dog shelter nearby. I think we're probably hearing them. Yeah. 
I'm not really sure what it is. I wish I could figure out what the letters used to be on it. There's a lot of letters in that name. Yeah. But, I don't know, because they would have had to either... Like, this road looks pretty established that we came in on. Mm -hmm. So, I imagine they would have came in through here. So, there's no way it's been used in a long time. Last 30 years, probably. Yeah. Old power lines and stuff. Want to try to get out? It just goes to the parking lot. Yeah. So did you enjoy the warehouse? That's pretty neat. Pretty neat? I That's did a good enjoy one. myself indeed. And they put all these barriers up to stop people from driving up here, but... Who does do that? I think that would stop about anything. Unless, you know, you can walk through it. Okay. Well, that's my second trip to this warehouse. I think I'm going to end the video here. Because that sounds good. Anything you want to say, Ethan? No, sir. Okay.